talking about Valentine's Day. Wheelchair edition, y'all. That's right. <coughs> Be quiet. My dog is so loud. <coughs> really? <coughs> really? We're going to do that? What up guys, it's Kimberly Rose here and I'm back with another wonderful video. I'm hitting you with the shoulders, hey. All right, so if you haven't subscribed, do it. But if you have, thank you so much and just welcome to everybody. Thanks for joining. This video I'm super pumped about because we're gonna be talking about Valentine's Day. All right, um, you see I'm in my pink, you guys. I got my pink donut in the background. All right, I am ready for this. So in today's video, it's going to be a Valentine's Day or night outfit idea video, um, but it's going to be a wheelchair friendly video, okay? Um, for So for my people that are watching the video who don't have a disability, who aren't in wheelchairs, you're probably like, sis, why your clothes gotta be different? You think you're better than us? What's up? Like, why, why the segregation? What's going on? First of all, I'm in a wheelchair, so you know, the clothes gonna be wheelchair friendly, but second, the clothes aren't any different than yours. Everybody can wear these clothes, all right? They're not adaptive clothing. They're not anything special or different. They're just more mindfully picked, okay? As a wheelchair user, we have to be more mindful of the clothing that we put on, all right? We can't just wear any type of jeans because if they low rise, they're gonna fall on the back and we gonna see butt crack. Nobody wants to see butt crack. You know, you can't wear certain heels, or you can, but certain heels just give you grief, okay? Because they just slide off the foot plate, they might get stuck in a hole in the foot plate, and it's all bad. You know, it can if you wear baggy clothing, it can rub in the wheel and get dirty. If you wear white pants, they can get dirty. You know, so it's just little tips and tricks that I've learned along the way with picking clothing. And I incorporate this into the video, and I want to share it with you all. Because I know that shopping in a wheelchair can be difficult. It can be a nightmare. I know. Trust me. I've lived it. I live it now. I know. So whether you are single, you're in a relationship, or you're just going out with your friends for Valentine's weekend, you want to be cute, right? So I'm giving you a few outfit ideas that I put together, I think that are super cute and that will work for the weekend and will work for my wheelchair people, okay? Um, do a quick, quick disclaimer, I am not a fashion expert, all right, y'all? I'm just somebody who likes to have fun with some clothes, okay? So if you think my outfits suck, cool. Make sure you like the video, all right? Um, but if you're interested in learning more about some of these outfits, stay tuned. All right, y'all. So style number one, I would say is more of a casual, semi-dressy type of look. I threw on a pink blazer from Forever 21 and got a satin tank top bodysuit on with jeans. The bodysuit's from Nasty Gal. Really easy to put on. Jeans from American Eagle. They have lots of stretch and they're high rise, which are perfect for my wheelchair users because they don't really ride low in the back. When you do your transfers, they stay on nicely. And the heels are from Forever 21. They're nude and a chunky heel. Chunky heels, I would suggest, are the best when you're in a wheelchair because they don't slide on and off the foot plate. I decided to take the jacket off and show you guys what it looked like without the jacket if you want to rock it like that. Okay, so for this look, this is a floral pantsuit that I got from Target. It wasn't too difficult getting on for me, although it was a little big in the boob area, but the pants part was fine. No, I'm not wearing shoes. Don't judge me. I was tired as hell changing out of all these outfits for y'all. My God. Paired it with the jacket and a belt. Took the jacket off to show you guys what it looked like without the jacket. And I thought it was pretty cute with jacket, without jacket. However you want to rock it. And depending on the weather. I'm in Texas, so it's kind of warm here. Well, today it is. Tomorrow, who knows. But, um, yeah, so this is the look. Uh, I was inspired by my name, Kimberly Rose, for this outfit. But, yeah, I thought it was cute. <laughs> So this is a super cute and flirty type of look. I really enjoyed putting this together. You could wear this during the day or night with heels or flats, you know, whatever you're feeling. The top is from Forever 21, and um, I'm not going to lie, I had a little bit of an issue with keeping the shoulders down. They kept riding up, but the jeans, love them. American Eagle, high rise and stretch, of course. <laughs> 
Okay, so for this look, I chose this beautiful blush blouse that I saw on the Nasty Gal website. And it was so pretty, and it's even prettier in person. Um, for my people with dexterity issues, I will say there's a button at the back of the neck. So if you can get that button open, you don't have to close it again. I don't have it closed in the picture. You can't even tell. Um, but it's still beautiful in person. And I rocked it with my blue jeans, high rise and stretch, of course. And you're good to go, honey. Slay. So the fifth look is this sexy red jumpsuit that I found in my closet. I got this from Goodwill about two years ago, if you can believe it. I was going to a friend's bachelorette party and I went and picked this up. And I found it recently and I was like, I can wear this Valentine's weekend. Why not? I plan on going to a concert. Sunday night and this would be really cute to wear to the concert would not wear this during the day you can but it's definitely not my style I paired it with some nude heels but you could probably pair it with black heels you know whatever kind of heels you want it was not difficult at all to get on actually this was probably the easiest outfit to put on and yeah this was the look <laughs> Last look, I did not get to record, but I thought this was super cute for brunch or date night. If you want to show a little bit more skin, it's Valentine's Day. Why not? <laughs> 